without putting on a uniform Smart when nuts and rode a unicorn through the storm Hey, what is going on guys? Clickwood here back again bringing you guys another video guys today What we're gonna be playing is plants vs zombies garden warfare 2 uh, This is a game from EA if you guys have not played this before I'm telling you I would really recommend giving it a shot It's one of the more fun just like hang out have fun type of games that I have played in a long long time I don't know if you guys remember, but I actually played quite a bit of the first Garden Warfare game, and this game seems to really bring every good aspect of that game and really condense it down and, uh, you know, just take the good aspects of that game and make it even better. So I think that uh, this game, for example, right now you're watching me play Team Vanquish, which is basically if you're used to playing other first-person shooter games, it's basically just a, a kill or be killed type of game mode. What you're playing to is the first team to 50 kills. Um, I'm using the Cactus, which is actually a long distance type of uh, character. I try to stay at a distance, which is you're going to see me, you can probably call it camping, I don't know, but um, you're going to see me play at a distance throughout the majority of this game because what I'm trying to do is take advantage of the fact that I get a high hit marker number per shot that I connect. Um, the problem, of course, is that I don't shoot very quickly with this character. So, uh, you know, right there I got like 33 or something like that um, on the very first hit that I connected with. And some of these characters have higher number of shots that they can take. But uh, even still, we can kill them usually with like three or at max four or five shots with this with this uh, cactus as long as they're not regenning and, and things like that. So that's why I really like this character because you can do a lot of damage in a very quick amount of time and you don't really have to risk you know getting killed very often because you're gonna typically play back from a distance like I am here you're gonna see my teammates a lot of them are rushing they're using other characters which is you know obviously the move depending on the character that you're using I really like to play kind of passively um, and then also actually you get this uh, this it's called an onion I guess it's kind of funny all the little things that they use but in this case we're using an onion and this thing can do like a little bit of damage with the standard gun that it has and you're gonna see me do some of that but um, the big thing is what I'm doing there I press the triangle button and it's actually a it's called a corn strike so what it does is it's basically like a, an airstrike or a missile that comes down it's like a, a bunch of different missiles that come down and it does take uh, a little bit of getting used to, and so, you know, you do have to kind of uh, anticipate where the opposing team is going to be, but at the same time, though, uh, I think that it, it's a really effective way to get a bunch of different kills, especially if you're playing a game mode where there's an objective or things like that, or there's a really strong choke point. It's really, really effective to use the corn strike with the cactus. And there's actually a couple other characters on both the plants versus and zombie sides uh, that can actually do that type of a, a damage. Um, some of them are more quick they don't have as long of a wait but they don't do as much damage or they're more condensed as far as like the the spacing right there you see me I, I do pop out of my onion but I did get a kill there because of it um, that guy was just standing there and he was trying to sit back and uh, and hit people from a distance so that's something that's really effective to do with the cactus as well um, you can kind of drop the missiles directly on those players who are just sitting there like if the opposing team right now they had one of their characters like the the pirate or, or something like that that can use the the parrot and go over and hit me he could have actually done a lot of damage on me here because I'm really not doing a whole lot of moving to be honest with you I'm just kind of chilling over here uh, waiting for my turn to uh, to hit these guys and right there we do get the kill the final kill of the game uh, we do go flawless in this game actually 10 and 0 with a few different assists it's a lot of fun though guys I hope you guys will try this out there's actually a lot of different game modes this is just a, a not a competitive game mode but um, you know a, a PvP type of game mode where I do do pretty well in this one so I hope you guys enjoyed it but there's actually a lot of different co-op game modes as well that you can do and you can just explore the world which I think is awesome uh, we didn't really have a whole lot of that in the previous game so in this game it's a lot more fulfilling to actually go out and explore and uh, you know pick up XP and things like that. So again guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, do me a favor, click that like button. I will probably be bringing you guys some more Plants vs. Zombies over the next couple of days and weeks. I'm really enjoying this game a lot, so I hope you guys will enjoy those videos as well. I'll still be bringing you guys plenty of content from other games as well, of course, but um, just wanted to bring you some Plants vs. Zombies to let you know about it and uh, let you know that I'm having a ton of fun playing. So thanks again guys, and I'll talk to you again soon.